Uh, once you were darling of the West, but now there's a huge gap in between. Well, 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 well I was asked this question by the BBC as mm -hmm. well. Uh, and I answered that um, uh, in, 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 in a way uh, that did not make me happy uh, afterwards. Uh, first of all, I would like to be the, the darling of the Afghan people rather than the darling of uh, uh, another country or the leadership of some other country. Uh, why was I the darling of the West? Did the West think that I would serve their interest as against the interest of the Afghan people? Uh, if it's uh, a compromise of interests, uh, then I'm sure um, they will be our darlings and we'll be their darlings. It will be two-way business. But if, it is, uh, but if it is coming from a, a viewpoint reminding us of, of, of Kipling's, Rudyard Kipling's uh, burden of the white man, uh, that we need to look up to the West all the time and that they always will lead us, will provide us, and that without them, uh, and if you are not their darlings, then we are bad and uh, a failure. Well, that is a troubling thought. If that thought is in the West, then I'm very unhappy about it.